Well, hello. How are you, friends? Good morning. I'm Mags. You're watching my Buffalo Divine. Thank you for coming to my channel. We're going to do a generalized reading today. I'm finishing up March readings. I've got a few left. I have no clue who's about to go, but let's go ahead and pick out of the jar. All right. Who do we have? Let's see. Drum roll. <laughs> what up, Leo? How are you? It's good to see you, my darling dears. This is a generalized reading. Take what resonates, leave the rest. I've had some channelings. Let's talk. I really heard the word posture. <clears throat> then I heard the word poised. I feel like this is a signal or something to you, Leo. There is something massive coming your way. There is something about being prepared and being ready, being very focused. You also may be having really bad uh, posture. So be aware of how you're sitting. Even when you're standing, are you hunched over? Uh, I also, while I said that, just saw a stand up desk. So you may be thinking or considering of getting a stand up desk, which I would highly advise as well. Uh, there's something there. Something else really else, please. I'm hearing a really fast drum roll. It's a Foo Fighters song. Oh, what is that? Oh my gosh, what song is that? It's in the intro. All right, so Foo Fighters are coming through. So uh, I just heard location, like where they're from. I'm not sure where the Foo Fighters are from. I, I don't know where they're from. Look that up. There's something about where the Foo Fighters are from or their music. You may want to listen to their music this week. Seeing a ball of red yarn. What does that have to do with anything? Tell me more. Red string. Red thread. Thread. There's a thread. Something's like hanging by a thread from happening. What? I just heard ball dropping. Okay, let's just get into it. I'm not quite sure. Leo, that's what I'm getting. Uh, I also heard a crow in the background as I was kind of going through those channelings. So spirit is here. Spirit is in the house big time. All right, spirit, angels, ancestors, guides, show me what's coming in for Leo, please. Sun, moon, rising, Venus. Do we need to go any further? That is a six of wands. Ah. Oh. I'm hearing all I do is win, 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 no matter what. <laughs> that's leo energy oh god this is i feel like i just got such a surge of power like and now i'm seeing a can of the of the pop called surge i don't even think it's around anymore yeah i just totally showed where i'm from by calling it pop i'm just gonna say that <laughs> Surge, it was kind of like Mountain Dew. Does anyone know what I'm talking about? I'm seeing a can of that. Okay, so Surge, there's something here about an energetic freaking Surge coming in for Leo. Tell me more. Ten of Cups. I can't. Two of Cups. Shut up. Shut up. I can't. What we got on the bottom of this? There it is. Empress. Y'all, holy cow. Are you serious? This is all headed your way, Leo? Two of Cups, Ten of Cups, and the Empress? And the Six of Wands? This is hands down the best reading I've had so far for March. I'm feeling divine counterparts here. I heard the word mastery. Tell me more. Coming for Leo, please. Thank you. Here, font. Divine order. Divine justice. 
God, source, your angels, your spirit team are telling me to tell you right now, 5.05 on the clock, they got your back, honey, okay? Damn. Anything else coming in for Leo, please? Ten of Swords. No more anxiety. This is an end to mental warfare. An end to bad cycles with your mental health. Really being in an analysis paralysis state of mind. This is over, Leo. It's over. Spirit is confirming it. Tens are for endings. And there's no real thing such as an ending, okay? It's always about the new beginning, a new cycle. It's everything is cyclical. Bottom of the deck, justice, okay? What I tell you about divine justice. This is Libra energy. You may have Libra in your chart somewhere, okay? Underneath that, the sun. Leo, this is one of the best readings you have had in so long. Oh my God, man. <sighs> okay, let me go ahead. I'm gonna stick that over here. We're gonna switch decks. We're gonna go to the Morningstar deck. Break it down, break it down. Tell us about the Six of Wands. Tell us about the Six of Wands. Bring complete emotional fulfillment for my Leo. Tell us about the Six of Wands, please. Justice again, holy crap, holy cow. Train horn confirmation if you heard it in the distance. Leo, I am a, a conduit for spirit. I work for spirit. I don't work for man. I feel so called to be giving this reading right now. Like, I feel like this reading in particular is a part of my destiny to get out to anyone who views this particular reading any leo that watches this particular reading there's something special about it tell me more tell me about this ten of cups please the world This person coming in is your world, Leo. This is, again, the end of an old cycle, the beginning of a new one. Look at the snake representing fertility, the egg, the feminine egg, divine mother, okay? The snake sheds skins, the snake is transformative. Aquarius. Scorpio, Taurus, Leo also on this card. That energy is here. You're encompassing all four at this time. You may have those other signs in your chart somewhere. I'm getting more. I'm being called to go get my globe right now. What? <clears throat> I put that back out in my living room. I'm being told to go get my globe right now and spin it for you for some reason, Leo. Here, on the bottom of the deck, right as I'm saying this, this is a second double confirmation. We've had two justice, two justice, or a justice, justice. We now have a Hierophant, Hierophant. I have to go get my globe. I'm sorry. We're gonna, I'm gonna just hold this. Give me two seconds. I'm gonna keep talking to you, Leo. Okay, I'm on my, I'm on my Bluetooth here. Let's talk. Okay, so there's something here about travel. Uh, Spirit is really acknowledging. They want you to have to focus on There's something here with this. This is going to be a huge, huge catalyst for you. All right. Here we go. Here's the globe. Hang on, let me do this. Okay, this landed in the United States. Holy fuck. Okay, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm getting the chills. This literally landed on where I'm located. Oh my God, that's so creepy. Woo! I'm jittery. Okay, let's look here. All right, I'm gonna tell you what's all down this meridian, y'all. 
Okay, I'm just gonna do, I'm gonna do this. How do I wanna do this? It's look right here. I gotta be able to see here. Port Hope, ain't that interesting. Detroit. I'm gonna say the cities right down the line or that are touching it. St. Louis is buttoned up against this. Washington, D.C., Nashville, Memphis, Jackson, Tampa, Houston. All of these, the names of the cities, the letters are somehow touching the meridian. Obviously, they're not in the same area, but the, I'm, t I'm reading what's touching this meridian here. St. Paul. Going down Belize. <clears throat> Havana. Costa Rica. El Salvador. Guatemala. Ecuador. That's the only one in South America that even touches it. Uh, anything else? Anything else? Managua. Nicaragua. Anything up here? We're looking uh Capus Capusing? Capus I can't say that. Capusca sing? <laughs> I don't know. Manzel. Alright, that's all I got. So I'm not sure what that means, Leo. It also was on my home state of Indiana, okay? So, you may have ties to any of those cities, states, countries that I just named. So we had Northern, Central, and Southern America, okay? So there's that. There's the globe. All right, you're the only one that got that this, this time. So let's go. Tell me more. It's coming in for Leo. My nose is itching. There's the high priestess. <laughs> My intuition's on point, y'all. My intuition is on point. Underneath that, the love card. They came out together. I cannot. I cannot. <sighs> what the hell have you manifested, Leo? This is phenomenal. This energy is exceptional. Spirit is so... So flabbergasted by what you have somehow just pulled off here. Tell me more. What's this two of cups? We had high priestess and love right prior underneath the empress. What's the two of cups? Thank you. Ace of swords on God. There's a truth. There's a truth. I deliver the truth. I speak the I speak the truth. I'm a child of God. All right. What I say, new beginnings. What I say. New beginnings. With every ending comes a new beginning. I can't freaking make it up. Leo. <sighs> Leo, I'm so fucking happy for you, man. Oh, or lady, whichever. Man, this is, wow. Tell me about the Hierophant Spirit. Give me a, a, a real message on that one. That's you all day. Thank you. Did you see that fly out? Completion. All right. Spirit on God. On God. <laughs> I'm here. I wanna, I'm seeing two fists, fist bumping right now. You and spirit fist bumping. Tell me about this ten of swords. Why is it over? There it is. What I say? It's over because the defeat, the essential question. Why is it over? Because you went through defeat, defeat and came through hell and back. You defeated your negative thoughts. You defeated those negative cycles. That's the essential question. Did you? Yes. The answer is yes. Do you not see these cards? Yes. You did it. You did it emotionally, mentally, spiritually, physically, whatever it is that you've been going through, Leo. Spirit's saying it's over. It's a new cycle. It's time for a new cycle. Okay. I. <laughs> Bottom of the deck. There you are. Okay. 1410 on the clock right when I held that up. That's one for one. Oh, God. Give me one message from Spirit specifically for Leo as they move forward with this amazing showering of blessings that are coming in. I am so happy for Leo. Oh, Leo. You needed this. You needed this. Your heart is so happy right now. It's about to be. You have no clue. You have no clue. You cannot comprehend what spirit has coming. What you think you know, you don't know. I'm hearing that. I'm hearing that loud and clear. What you think you know, you know nothing of how good and how sweet this is going to be. 
this next chapter. It's a new life. I'm talking to Leo's with a new life coming in. All right. Tell me more spirit. A new life. Tranquility. Trust. All will turn out well. Everything will fall into place. Peace of mind and tranquility will result. That's an angel coming forth and delivering that message to you, Leo. Uh, I'm now seeing a beautiful bouquet of white roses. That is so pure and, oh, it's so pretty. I can smell them. I can smell them. Wow. I'm not being called to pull a divine feminine card because for me to have that with white roses and that's, um, I'm just going to put this out there. White roses are very significant to me personally. Um, but I was thinking of Easter lilies this morning. So I had no, I had no intention of even thinking of roses. Those that just came to mind. So there's something here with that message for you. Okay. There's a divine feminine that I feel is going to come through on this message and give you a specific message with regards to your divine feminine energy. Because Leo, we all have divine feminine, divine masculine. There's a message here from, from a divine feminine energy or something, a spirit. I don't know. Tell me. Okay, here we go. Joan of Arc, the warrior of light. I have a steel-like faith in myself. The angels armor me with conviction. Hmm. Leo, you're being rewarded for your fight and your determination and your tenacity. You never gave up. You never lost faith. And it is time for you to be rewarded. Okay? Mm, congratulations. I'm leaving it there, Leo. I hope that this resonated. If you'd like to go a little bit further on a one-on-one -on -one private reading, all the information is in the box below. As always, I appreciate all of your love and your likes and your subscribes and your comments. I love reading your comments. I am so happy for you. I know for a fact you've earned this. Every single Leo I know has just truly had to almost recreate themselves this last few years here. And I just, uh, from the bottom of my heart, I just, I know how you feel and I love you and you are worth it. And you have got amazing things coming in, my friends. So I hope you have a fantastic rest of your week. And in the meantime, take care. Bye, Leo.